Welcome to Gymcastic. My name is Jessica. I'm here with Spencer from the Balance Beam Situation. We are a weekly gymnastics podcast, and during the 2018 Doha World Championships, we are doing watch-alongs. So if you'd like to watch along with us, you can go to the Olympic Channel link that's in the description and below. And if you go to the two minutes... Three minutes. That's a three. That's a, I can't see that far. Three minutes, 28 seconds. <laughs> three minute, 28 second mark. Then you can watch along with us. So I'm going to count to three, and when I say play, hit the play button on your computer. Okay, are we ready? I'm ready. One, two, three, play. I hit it twice accidentally. <laughs> We're off to a great start. <laughs> it's the last day. We're oh already God, loopy. Day, <laughs> Whew, how do the gymnasts feel? Like, we can barely hold oh, it together? Yeah. Okay. That's why, like... Simone's always giggling, probably, because <laughs> she's like, I'm just so <laughs> tired. So um, we were watching Dom Cunningham. Preparing for the men's vault. From the British. Where the hope is that no one will die. Right. But you're never sure. That's always the number one. Mm -hmm. uh, Dom is a big fan of cars and uh, fixing them and maybe he driving them He was doing so well. <laughs> so <laughs> perhaps he has, you know... The death-defying men's vault is right up his alley because yeah. he's really into the. He's car not things. one of the scariest vaulters, though. No, he's especially not. with the vault he's doing right now. No, and he's so clean and beautiful in his gymnastics. There is like you feel like when you watch him vault, there is a zero percent chance he's going to die. But for some of the right. people we'll see later, it's a non-zero percent chance that they're going to die while we're watching them in this final. Yep, exactly. Dominic. See? With a K at the this end of the Dominic. So loopy, I'm already laughing. At You're just laughing at the name Dominic, which is a perfectly <laughs> normal name. name. <laughs> <laughs> Say all of the people's names in a weird voice during this final. I think that's what we need Dominic. to do. <laughs> Good crowd again. Yep. Well, well no. as they cut to, though that's the side. There's yeah. no one on we the have side. The middle, the yeah. middle is looks solid. So we're seeing the Taishan vault, which we found out from Uncle. Uh, <laughs> It's Coach Rick, not Uncle Rick. No. Coach Rick, there was, who you guys should go to gymnasticscoaching.com. He aggregates all the news and gives his opinions on things, and he's been a brevet coach, coaches all over the world. We respect hey, him very much. Um, he found out, he forgot, that Tyshawn had been sanctioned by the FIG previously. In 2014. Um, and we don't know exactly. The link is, just, is no longer working. But then it was up, because it's published in the magazine. Oh. So we'll take a look at that and get back to you. But, all right, here Dom goes. Dom Cunningham's vaulting. A Ooh! good man biles. A man biles. It was very nice. <laughs> the poor man. I know, Simone someone... does this vault once, and it's we're like, yeah. oh, the men. Yes. Now I guess they're going to do a biles, well, too. Well, it, it serves them right for no one ever uh, entering that as a skill yeah, to be named, named after them. Named, so it's, it's their in the own men's code, damn but it's not fault. named after anyone. You could have had it named after you. Because it takes Jerry. way too long to say round off, half on, lay out, double, full. Like, that's, I can't deal with that. Right. Man biles. I have places to be. Who did it better, Dom or Simone? I think Simone can do it better. Here, like, in, you know. Legs and feet. Yeah. Simone. Form wise. Simone can. Yeah, like, so she fell the once. First, yeah, the first time we saw her do it, when she did it at the selection camp. Yeah. Yeah, that was the mm -hmm. most perfect vault ever of all time. So men, you know, it's possible to get this retroactively named after you, apparently. So whichever Only man, if, if, you're you, Nelly. <laughs> if you think, 1976, no. I invented the double back. No, you didn't, you did Nelly. Not. You really didn't. Um, no, Mr. Chile, porn stash. Oh, yeah, Tomas Gonzalez. Tomas Gonzalez got a skill from the 2003 Worlds retroactively named after him. Because for a lot of people, like, their federation is crap and they weren't doing their job. So, you know, now he's the president of his own federation, so he's, he's doing like. the right things. He's like, hello, you didn't do this for me. So I would say the guys should go back and, you know, get it. How do you after prove them. it? You have to have done it at Worlds or Yeah, Olympics. but you, how do you prove that you were the first one? Second vault, triple, Yurchenko triple twist. Nice. Step back, good landing position, all definitely all the way around. It looks so easy when he yeah. does that. That was a Yurchenko triple. Yes, it was. And it looks so easy. Mm -hmm. Those were two very good vaults. It's all that time he spends working on cars. I'm telling you. That's like his I puppies. feel like that might not have anything to do with it. <laughs> Just maybe. It's all that time he does gymnastics? 
Is Maybe. that what you're saying? Mm. Maybe. Working on that. Mm-hmm. Here now we get our seven time. million replays. I'm glad we actually. This is actually a replay of the vault and not a replay of his feed. Like I thought it was yes, going to be. Yes. God. Ooh, socks. <laughs> <laughs> um, a sporting event. They have done so. That's round off. He gets a really nice push off. Mm-hmm. There's not a lot of crossed legs. Yeah. Not yeah. bad. Not perfect form, but good direction. Really nice block. That's the thing he got. You notice, like most men, he puts his hands out yeah. to the side. Like and so Mal- he'll get a good Malani. execution score, Malani. but so will everyone else for every single vault. I and mean, if we talk about women's vault, you have to die to get below a nine <sighs> execution right. score. On men's vault, you really have to die to get below a nine. So nine two. Nine execution. two. I think that actually, like, for the standard of men's vault that we that's see, low. Where that feels kind of low. Super low. Because basically, you can give yourself two black eyes, <laughs> land on a judge knock them out and still get a nine. So it seems like he should have yeah. gotten a higher like score. Like the weakest form gets like right. eight, eight. So this is... Shek Wai Hung. From... Hong Kong. Hong Kong has a representative in the vault final, which is very exciting. Very exciting. So they have to push their... You can't start farther than the uh, that Longines sign. That's the limit. <laughs> so everyone puts their feet right up against right it. Right up against it, yeah. Dragulescu got it around. Didn't die. Didn't die. His knee, it was like only like five out of ten knee explosions. Right. So that's like okay that's for a really men's good. ball final. Yeah. I'll take I'm it. I'm happy with that. Yeah. It looked like he had pretty good form in the air too. Yeah, his he was not crazy cowboyed. Yeah. I mean, and I also appreciate his earring. I don't know if it's modest. Let's be honest. True. Good point. Probably I don't think it's modest. modest. I think it's playing the character of another human. His legs were, I mean, his knees might have actually been together. At least for some of that which they were, which is an accomplishment. Which might be the first time that's ever happened in a Dragulescu. Wow, yeah. look at that. That's that is a really, really good, good form for that ball. shape, yeah. And just that little hop to the side. Yeah. I'm impressed with him. So that's the same difficulty as Don Cunningham's second fault, the Urchenko triple fall. So where do we think this should compare to that one execution score wise i mean i feel like he should get i feel like he should get higher ex, d- 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 higher e yeah by at least like half a tenth yeah but i feel like it should be pretty like i'm okay with this being pretty close because he did have nine one so so a little bit lower lower yeah hmm. I he think it was the landing. The hop, I think yeah. it was the landing control I hopping to the side a, rather yeah. than that little step. I forget about the landing. I know all you want is it, what's in the, in the air, air, and you want everyone to land into a pit. But I know the landing <laughs> is how safe it was in the air, and you know we should just have a pit here because. Second. Also going for a five six second vault, so he will have a two tenth difficulty edge over Don Cunningham. Ooh. Kazumatsu double full. Pretty uncontrolled on the landing. Way uncontrolled on the landing. Extremely uncontrolled on the landing. Stupendously uncontrolled on the landing. A couple large lunges. He also has like horseshoes taped to the back of his Achilles, which is interesting. Horseshoes? He's not a horse. It it either looks like he has, um, he has, uh, when can you see it? Like maybe. What is that? It, they're ripped off, or he has his Achilles is a, is a ripped where off. Where is it? See, I mean, I see tape, but it looks like it's hanging off. It's like I can't quite I see where it is. What? It, well, it's probably conspiracy. There's something weird. There's a conspiracy on the back of his. <laughs> maybe it's just ripped and it's just his hanging. Ankle has a huge conspiracy. But in the air, that's really nice. Mm-hmm. A little legs, a little cross at the very end, but he didn't. Kill any of the judges. He didn't kill any of the judges. I mean, now, not that far away from killing some of the judges. Who do the judges think they are sitting down for these Sitting vaults? down. Right. Lazy. Get up and move your tables back. You did a good job, sir. <laughs> well done. But uh, I think the landing on the second vault should put him behind Dom Cunningham. Yeah, I agree. Uh, but also, it's like, you know, you can't see directly up into the light. So why are the women doing the correct thing, the female judges, and standing back so that they can see the whole vault, and the men are just looking straight up into the lights. Eight seven execution. Yeah. The out of bounds penalty. Mm-hmm. So yeah, you have to like basically lunge several miles backward to get an eight seven execution. This is the standard that we're seeing on men's vault. But yes, laziness is the answer for the judges. Pretty much, that's the only excuse. They just want to be sitting there. Maybe they can see fine. We have no idea. We're just no, going to complain laziness. about it here from at home, <laughs> where we obviously know best. 
Oh, this leotard. Nikita Nagorny. Yeah, Check tell me it. about it. It's gold. It's, it's the so gold. Russian. Yeah, and then it has the red. It almost looks like, you know, someone blood was splatter. shot. Yeah. Blood, blood splatter. Okay, Nikita Gordy has the strongest legs and booty in the whole entire world, so I expect something magnificent from him right now. Also doing the Dragulescu. That is a good one. That was a great one. That's a pretty good one. He didn't stick it this time. A small hop back. No. But and it's a huge, massive, big fatty cowboy. Yes. In the air. But his landing was very nice. Now his chest is right up. He's not yeah. landing it like in a triangle shape. Which is the case on many Draguleski, Draguleski. Yeah, I mean yeah. legs apart, that hot back. That's like, and the really thing all is, I have. from this, you can totally see the cowboy from the side. There's oh, no yeah. like you no, know he'll deduct for it, but like right. it's not the most important right. part of. the And ball. he was able to pull into first position with the way that his feet were. That his feet weren't too far apart that he couldn't pull into fl- first position at the end there with his little hop back. So mm-hmm. that's a little ding. So what we're saying is him. that was a really good vault. It was a very good vault. And it's probably because he has that gold metallic. <laughs> that murdered eagle? The eagle of the Soviet. I don't know the story about that eagle. I don't but know the story I, it looks, eagle either. I feel like it looks just like the same eagle that's on our stuff and on like every country has that same in Germany. It's like all the same. It's the Illuminati. <laughs> so 14-8 it's for that vault. Which is, so that's a 9-2 execution as well. The same as Don Cunningham's Yurchenko Triple Fall. Separation, please. Yes. That's all we ask. A little more. A little more separation. I think that hit Nagorny's was better. Now, our favorite part about watching Nagorni warm up is how he just takes one step onto a board and does a double front. <laughs> That's the setup on the that? side there. I think you can see it. Oh! A little short You're out of there. Out. Done. Done. Kazumatsu double fold, Over. but pretty short of rotation. Knees. I'm going to say his knees touched the ground. I don't think his knees touched the ground. Mm. I think it was deep, and then he lunged to save it. Oh, you think that the mat... Jumped up to touch his knees, like I no. love you. Well, kind of. It's very loose. You've it's been talking super about how loose, loose the it ma- is. The mats it could are, have jumped. The mats up. are a huge But I think problem. he saved that, lunged forward several times. Mm. But I guess the proof will be in the replay. Form really nice. Uh... I'm right. I'm right. I mean, is does it have to be pressure on the mat? Or just it doesn't even t- it doesn't touch. even touch it. Mm. It doesn't touch the mat. It's deep. He'll there get huge deductions. So his form is really good here, and then his legs cross and his knees bend. So and his, his form is cross, and then yeah. No, you're right. He's, in terms of short of rotation, he'll get credit for going around yeah. the sufficient number of times. But it's like we There's, were talking about yesterday on men's floor. It was like one foot was there, and the other one was kind of making a ninety degree angle. So. Yeah. It's a deduction, but... 8-9, told you. Okay. 14 <laughs> average, so he's in second. Behind Dom Cunningham still. Dom Cunningham still rosy from his vault. It's a lot of work. <gasps> so here's Risa Guam. Risa Guam's on you guys! <laughs> Oh my god! This it's, is sometimes like you're kind of worried he's about to be dead. It is, but it's like the magical time of year when he comes out of <laughs> like the special hut where he lives and trains in darkness. It's like seeing a unicorn every time you get to see him, or like, or like the northern lights, or it's so special. And there he is again, year after His year. His nickname should be the North Korea Lights. The North Korea Lights. I like that. The Aurora Bori Korea. <laughs> okay, we have to talk about this fault. <laughs> So he's doing the Rise Guang, which is, or the Pike to Dragulesco. Right. So it's a double front pike and then a half out. It achie- it has the remarkable uh, quality of achieving all of the shapes in one vault. He's <laughs> straddled, piked, and tucked all at the same time. Yes. He starts <laughs> off in a ballet class and ends on a stripper pole. <laughs> That's what happens. We're going to say ends in a grave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So. It's such a hard vault. It's, it's such insane. a hard vault. It's insane. He lands a little, you know, deep as you would with a lunge to the side. I don't think that should get credit as a pike. 
I, I think that's tucked. If you start, the first one is definitely piked. The second one is... So is the skill is a, a front straddle, single pike and then a tuck? It's a straddle it's, The first pike. one is a straddle pike. The half turn is a tuck. So I think that the way men's men's is judged, that he gets credit for it. Oh, I know he gets credit for right. it. I just don't think Your he personal should. feelings. My personal feelings about it are bleh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a yucky. It's it yucky is. to it's, look at. It's hideous, but the, <laughs> in men's 8, 9, 3, 3. I mean, he's getting it lower. 8, 9 to 9, 2 is right. the range. That's all That's all the range they that, give these judges. You know, because they don't, they let ha- them they have, don't have 10 other. points of execution no. score to work with. They it's took, three tenths. They took away all the other numbers. <laughs> it's only an 8 or a 9 for those first two digits. And that's it. But it is still a magical time we get to see him. Yeah. I mean, let us take a moment. There he is. And does he have bionic ankles? I mean, have they replaced him? There has to that be place. something unusual going on there because they are should be gone. Oh, that was nice. I thought it was going to make it. It was nice. Yeah. I mean, his legs are apart, whatever, but it's but much vault. Like, it was definitely tucked and intended to be tucked the whole yes. time. Chest pretty well up on landing. And nobody had to carry him off because yeah. he's walking on his own. He's walking on his own two ham hocks. Oh. <laughs> That's the only way you can land these vaults. Yeah. If you have, like, just gone to a grocery store, gone to the frozen meat section, and just with some duct tape and just taped a bunch of meats around your legs, that's the only way you can land these vaults. Full twist. Look at that. That's insane. Yeah. I like how he's kind of drunk when he lands it. Yeah, well, you he's would like be. Anybody that's... Stat- <laughs> he has like, he lands and then he's like, uh, uh, oh, oh, I don't know how to walk in a straight line. <laughs> I mean, he's starting that tuck as soon as possible because he wants to live. So you can't right. blame him for that. Like we said, that's our right. new slogan, right? right? Living is a good Live idea. Is a good idea. Yeah. And also, I like how he lands because it's a big old squat with their legs apart like you're lifting weights, which is the way you should be landing this because it is biomechanically safe to land like that. Oh, he's taking off his tape. Oh, my God. What's, what's under, under there? there? Are there a million scars? We think he has had full ankle replacement surgery. <laughs> um, yeah. With robot ankles, because I think he ha- his ankles he are made walk. of vibranium. He does something. have a big scar on his um, on his uh, cat on the top of his on his shin. I wonder if they put a rod in there. Mm. And you'll never know until up it, next is Artur Davtian of Armenia. Who finally made a world's final, which is very exciting because he's yes, been around for forever. a while vaulting. He also has a Dragulescu, so we know he has the difficulty to be here. Nice to see him in the final. As we still wait for the judges to decide what shape Rise Guang is. <laughs> Indeterminate. Okay. He's going. Daftian's going now. Big Damn! high Dragulescu. That's our best amplitude. Period. End of story. This is why they need to add, just like uh, skateboarding has and snowboarding has, the the laser on the side, which they're using the, the robo judging here so they could do it. But not shows. for actual judging. Right, right? not they're for actual judging. They're it. testing it, which they should be. But you could say, you could add that into the judging because you could say, not just I think that was high, you could say like literally he went 15 feet in the air where everybody else was just at 10 feet in the air. Mm-hmm. You could have standards, like you could have a specific right. height standards and then you hit the like beep. And then you, you get, get a the bonus and you for get getting even higher. Or a lack of deductions for getting even higher. I mean, he just kicked out too early. Yeah, so that's why he landed all. Right. Also, knees did not touch the mat, but close. No, yeah, but close. And he actually started in a real nice, clinchy tuck. Mm-hmm. So I feel like it's going to be on the 8-9 end of the range, but it should be get some sort of reward for the height. Yeah, because that was big time. Eight eight three three. We have a new we have a new low in the range. That's unacceptable. I don't accept that because his landing should have been offset by his incredible form in the first tuck and his amplitude in the first tuck. And good for him for just sitting down and waiting and reserving his energy for his vault, because he's now been here for like three weeks <laughs> and had to wait a week to just compete for, for score, twenty yeah. seconds. Five six also the difficulty for a second vault. Do you like the regularized vaulting difficulties 
like across the vault so it's like you see a five six or a five two we're not like bouncing all over the place like this one's five five or this one's five six ah! also a kazumatsu double oh. fall could not control it damn it did a, but he did do like a full turn out of right the landing. which should be a bonus obviously yeah so some connection bonus at least yeah but he did put his hand down. Oh, he's so bummed. Twirling, twirling out of it. It was such a nice vault. It was just totally out of control. Yeah. The problems for him were, was not the technique or the yeah. form. It was, he just went too, she just went too hard. So let's watch this replay. He's, uh... Yeah, a little bit of leg crossing, but. Oh, was he's over rotated. That's what happened. He's over rotated, so he totally couldn't. That was his save from landing on his butt. Yeah, and then he had to tap out. Yeah, went too hard. Damn it! So close to not. Oh. You know, it's such a bummer because it's taken him so long to get. Like he's such a great gymnast, and we rarely get to see him in the finals. But he was in the final. He was in the final, so that's really so, good. Yeah. And I feel like Armenia should give him a bonus. A Lots of Armenian bonus. finalists because they had two in the rings finals as yeah. well. They didn't get anyone into the pommel horse final as we would have expected. Harutin Merdinian did not make the pommel horse final, but otherwise, the Armenian event med- event specialists made their finals. Eight one three three execution. Well, he did put his hand down. An eight one. So you can you fall and you get an eight one. <laughs> oh, you think because it's too high? Yes, I yes. agree with you. I thought you meant like, oh my god, we saw an eight one. That should be a else is like seven eight, eight. one. Well, that was yeah. a fall. Yeah, but like that's not the score we're seeing. Those aren't the scores we're seeing <laughs> compared to everyone else. Right, because me- vault scoring is stupid. That's ridiculous. What they didn't take the fall deduction then? Yeah, they probably did. Otherwise, it would have been like a nine one, which we've been seeing in this final. This whole thing is stupid. I can't stand men's vault. I can't stand <laughs> vault judging. Okay, Dark Sam time. So we call him Dark Sam because he you, looks like... You, Jessica calls him Dark Sam. It's Caio Souza from Brazil. woo That was gorgeous! That was gorgeous. a good, that was Holy a good mother. Cosmo 2 double fall. That was beautiful. Mm-hmm. Wow. He had the lunge back, but in terms of being fully rotated, control, chest up, that was one of the better ones. Best one? Best, Best one. one. I, th- I think that was better than Dom Cunningham's. Dom Cunningham didn't do this I know, this but vault, his just but, twisty in okay. the air is what I mean. Yeah. Yeah. Cunningham did a whole nother twist, but the air of twisty form. Look at that. Legs together, toes pointed, just a little yeah, bit just at a the little, end. just loses a little at the end, but. And that leg separation this, on the yeah, block. Which nobody tends to notice or ever take a deduction for, no. as far as I can tell. No, we there we have the screenshots of, like, Tatiana Nebiova <laughs> to... Right. <laughs> to prove it. Just like, the arched full boop, straddle. Boop. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Yeah. 9033 execution score, Jessica. Lower than the 92 that Don Cunningham for, got for his Yurchenko triple fall. Just I so mean, you can keep track landing. of like the murdering that you're gonna do. <laughs> for the landing, then. He's going for a Dragulescu second fall. What you do in the air count more. More? Yes. Than the landing. It never has. I don't know why. I'm insisting on it now. It's never been a thing. <laughs> that oh, is... crap. Yeah. So that's a f- that is a fall. That's definitely. an actual fall. And a definite so cowboy. So will he get a seven in execution? Yes. He should get a seven because I think form-wise he was also weaker than Davtion. Who got an eight one three three? We'll see. I think he should get a seven. Who knows what it's going to be? Oh, that's such a bummer because his first one was so nice. Oh, oh his head touches! Damn, his giant noggin <laughs> got in the way. I mean, not first. It doesn't touch first, so we won't get a zero. But yeah. Oh, oh his head was the first part of him to fall. So Bar. that's not great. It's yeah, not that should good be when your an head is lower score than in the, the rest of your body. If your head yeah. can touch the mat. Oh. And you're, you've actually yeah. ripped your thighs apart in the air. Yeah. Damn it. He should have stayed tucked longer because 
He and just, just done the double front. I agree. <laughs> <laughs> I should have said because he sort of kicked out a little to land. He should have just held that tuck, but then he would have landed in a full squat and tucked his and touched his seven butt. eight three three execution. Finally, a correct score. Well, if you thought Davtian, Jessica's so waving cute. at her <laughs> beloved. If you thought Davtian should be have been a seven one, then that's not a correct score. But at least it's a seven for crying out loud. Yeah, comparatively correct. Kenzo, <clears throat> it's gonna be Kenzo, Kenzo alert. Except this is Risa Guang. We have to see. We have to see a lot of like chalking and waiting because they don't right. have anything else to show. But at least they're not just showing randoms. And trying they're showing to... the people involved in the competition. I'm trying to make the the vault less death defying by putting all the marinating things on it. it. <laughs> yes, marinating. <laughs> Got to soften up that tough piece of meat. <laughs> oh, Kenzo. Oh, Kenzo, he's just she so win all the things. Also for being. Why isn't there a congeniality award? He should win that. Those are stupid. <laughs> ah! Oh, did not stick his Yurchenko oh, triple fall this so time. Close, close, just a little short. Not tried to really hang on to close. it. He did, and a big pikey Step forward. Pull. Yeah, I want to see how pikey was just on landing, or whether that was just leaning to try to hold the stick position. The form. I mean, there's a little legs. Ah, uh, <sighs> yeah. Kenzo. Damn it. It was only great. It wasn't better than great. Ah. Yeah, he is a little under-rotated. Mm -hmm. This is a bummer. I agree with this lady who's clapping with her fan. Mm -hmm. You're you're happy, but you're like... It gets, mm, it's Kenzo, so you're automatically I'm happy concerned. because it's Kenzo. <laughs> <sighs> You've got this, Kenzo. You can do it. The camera, now we're getting more crowd shots. The cameras are so pleased that the Japanese fans brought all their flags. And so all they're wearing them. all their and stuff. And they're wearing all their stuff. They're like, yes. we're going to show you endlessly because of I something do love, this show. is a universal thing. This isn't special for gymnastics. Like, if you watch wrestling, they all have the headband on and the whole thing. So. 915 execution for Kenzo. Mm. It's on the upper end of I mean, the execution scores we've seen. As it should be. But Dom Cunningham so far is still my form champion. Okay, Same. I mean, it's okay. <laughs> Ooh, only five two wow. difficulty. He's only going for the Kaz one and a half. And he also doesn't take his full steps. He's Kenzo. He we don't need full steps. Mm -hmm. oh! That's a stick. That's oh! a stick. Kenzo, everybody. Kenzo, what's up? That's right. Oh, yeah. He looked no, like he was surprised by that landing. Yeah, he's like, finally, God. Or, But like he was still kind of twisting into it and was like, oh, I oh, guess I'm staying My right leg stayed Boop. intact. And now he's high-fiving all of the people in the competition, even the coaches and the other competitors, and shaking hands with all of them. Oh, and Kenzo. doing a very halfway. And now is he going to shake hands with <gasps> Risa Guang on the floor? Yes. Oh, and, and a give hug. A hug. It's just like if you get to touch a North Korean, it's like amazing. And all these gymnasts. <laughs> what do. happens? It's just like it, you're Magical one of powers. the only people in the whole world who's ever gotten to shake hands. And that's like one of the special things about being an athlete is at this level is you get to mini nice interact. Nice form, just a little le foot crossing at the end. He's like, oh, I can hold I this. Did I can hold it. I can. Hmm. This is good. I'm squeezing this is where my I butt. Land. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so nine. I'm going to say 9-3. Yeah. Mm. So it'll be like a 9-2. Yeah. 9-4. Whoa! Big spender. Look, even he's like... <laughs> the so judges are second. crack. <laughs> even he's surprised Kenzo's by that. Like, ha -ha, the scoring. The sport's a joke. <laughs> <laughs> Lol. Oh. So Risa Guang's in first. That moves Kenzo into second, just ahead of Dom Cunningham. Which always proves, as we've already known about Vault, that if you try to kill yourself but don't die, don't die, then you can win. This yeah. is the Riseguan rule. Mm -hmm. Well, his toes can wiggle on their own, so I'm going to say the oh, but he covered him up right then. I don't think he wants. He didn't want the to camera see to see his secret his feet. Secret his secret feet magic that have feet. been replaced <laughs> at least two or three times. Last Vaulter, Daloyan, all around champion. You can tell him apart from Ngorni from his. Because they look different. <laughs> you can tell them apart because they're two different people. They totally with look different. Different hair color and different faces. But if you want to go by tattoos. He has that big cross. He has the big cross. Yeah. And a different leotard. I love when they all wear their own different leotards. 
Because it's an individual competition. It's not a team sport. By the way, he's got to be so tired. Oh, that's an odd trotty. Run. <laughs> I like it. Oh, that Triple was really fall. nice. That was really good. Just to hop forward. I like it. Oh. It was like knees up on that. Yes. Run. It was. It was like a, a prance. Oh, my God. And I'm going to have to hold up. St. Pavlova for his Ooh. next vault because did you notice the lady in the audience was wearing like a a tribute to St. Pavlova? Tr- yes, clearly that was the whole situation on her head. Mm-hmm. So it looks like a Greek Orthodox, Russian Orthodox headdress. I don't know what that's called. Sure. His run is very strange. It is. For Pavlova. Uh, perfect. Club Gym yeah, members can win these in November. A little bit of short, a little bit of hop, but He's going to be in this for another medal. Yeah, he's definitely in it. I would like him to tie with Dom Cunningham at this point. Okay. Yeah, that was really nice. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's just going to be lots of deductions because... But no, there aren't because men's fault. Because men's fault. There aren't going to be that many deductions. Right, and by many deductions, I mean five tenths. Comparatively, <laughs> it'll be like eight tenths right. or something. Ooh, nine, two, nine, six, two. six, seven and a third tenths were taken off. So now he is... 14.866, that's really high. Yeah. That's almost like what Rise Guang was getting. Oop. Oh, Rise. He's playing with his bionic ankle. He's going to have to switch that out before yeah. he can get on the plane. He won't be able to get through security with that. Yeah. He has retractable feet, is what we're telling right. you. He can just press a button and they go... Maybe, uh, he can have a rest. Mm-hmm. Then when he needs to vault. See? I see her now. Right? That's definitely the same as our prayer candles. We're with you, lady. <laughs> God, what if we made those and gave them away? That sounds hard to it make. It does sound really hard. But <laughs> I don't want to do that. Gym, gym nerds would wear that, <laughs> especially <laughs> if it had like a symbol of Simone in the middle or Mustafina. Second fault, double yeah, in. Double front pike. Oh, that was beautiful. That was Just, beautiful. That was very good. He's getting a medal. That's the, my. Th- I think that's my favorite vault of That was final. a beautiful vault. I don't care about it. He took a step. He was piked yeah. in the air. The whole time, it out. not straddled was, or tucked he, he at all. Actually, One held shape. his shape. That was lovely. Yeah, that was beautiful. He should go out there and enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> Which we've right. now proved you do not know the order. Of no, those words. I don't. <laughs> I mean, he's a little, a little tucking, right. but a it was hard bit, to see in real not time. Like, it's not not piked. Yeah, it's just a deduction. Like from this angle, it looks perfect. Yeah. That was really even Dom is also. It sounds like oh, I, well, I didn't know. Like, well, I was gonna buy myself another car engine, but so high. Yeah. That's like Michaela Maroney height. That's now the highest fault yeah. of the final, I think. That was ginormous. Yeah. Nikita, who looks looks nothing, nothing like, like him. Arthur. They don't look the same at all. But no. I'm just telling you, sometimes some people have trouble some people telling might them have apart. Trouble telling them apart, right? Yeah. So just in case. Mm-hmm. So that's why you like one has is labeled <laughs> with that cross. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you just went up and went. Boop, boop. So it's gonna <laughs> You're be the other one. I'm gonna say it's gonna be uh, second place. Right, yeah. You didn't get time to predict. So Reese, <laughs> is that so, what you were going to say? So Dom is out. Dom's out of the medals. Risa Guang is gold. Arta Daloyan is silver. And Kenzo is bronze. Oh, now international world peace. North Koreans are all like, I know, damn. North but Koreans are giving a standing ovation standing because ovation. they're gymnast one, and that's world peace. And no, everyone should be giving a standing ovation because when you get <laughs> okay. to see Risa Guang. Two Guan smiles and furious. And his military face in the crowd. <laughs> He can't smile. What if that I was know. interpreted as like I know liking but Western anything, and then they murder so him? It makes me so happy because I agree with his face. <laughs> and I'm like, I wish I could do that in pictures and just be like, like a North Korean or a Russian, where it was just socially acceptable he, when someone's like, smile, and, and you like, would just go. That's what I would like to be able to do. Dom, oh my God, he is so close. Tenth, a tenth. Oh. <sighs> But I mean, I'm good with this. Yeah. Yeah. I wish Dom and uh, Kenzo had tied because you know I feel and I actually ties. wish Daoloyan had been given the gold and Rise Guang yeah. the silver because of form. There's some actual Qatari dudes 
or whoever they are, but they're wearing a thobe, so they're local. I'm going to say they're local dudes, okay. which we've only seen twice in all the broadcasts. All right. Let's so watch his replay again. We get to see. Oh, this is the this is the good one. Yeah. Sick. Yeah. That's, a, that's the one that gets you drunk. That's the so one that hard. gets you drunk. That's like a gold medal <laughs> He's vault. drunk, the other one. pregnant, all the things at once after that. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's yep. a score. He doesn't get a score. He just gets drunk and pregnant. Drunk and pregnant, which is <laughs> <laughs> all the best things at once if you're a male vaulter. Uh, yeah, everyone should have given that a standing ovation. Yeah, Dom, that's right. You're still good. <laughs> all right. So, if you want to catch us every single week, we're at jimcastic.com or anywhere that you listen to podcasts, uh, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, all those places. And if you want to watch more of us, we are going to watch Women's Beam and something else. Women's Floor and Men's High Bar, (coughs) because that's the most exciting one. Yes. So, we'll see you back on those episodes. Thank you so much to TumbleTrack and to Club Gemini members for supporting our work.